Best of Two Worlds premiered in Lagos two days ago and Bobriski won Best Dressed Female. A whopping check of 1 million naira was given to him and people have been pretty offended, especially ladies in the movie industry, the Yoruba movie industry actually. And Bobriski has come out to defend Femi Adebayo who actually issued or rather announced the award. Bobriski has come out to say, look, it wasn't him who picked me. They had judges. Let's hear from Bobriski. Enough of this mic. Cho, 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 cho. 10 points won. Jesus. <laughs> You're blocking my light. Hello. Okay, so guys, I want to address this once and for all. I went to my sister's movie premium, and ever since I attended the premium, so you have to lose your lose, lose from yours. Ever since I, I went to her for the premium, you know, I've been getting series of people coming out to say, oh, why are you digging for Brisky the best female dress? She's not the woman. They are even coming for Bra Femi, Uncle Femi. Now, let me tell you, because a lot of you are not there. So, we, that we are there. We will tell you what happened there. Okay? So, you can stop you know, going to insult someone or stop judging them without even getting to know the real facts of the whole thing. Number one, Uncle Femi, was, Uncle Femi did, not pick, did not pick the winner. They already, had, they already had judges that was meant to pick the winner for the, um, the most probably well-dressed female for the theme of the movie. So Uncle Femi was just to come there and just announce the winner. He was not the one that picked the winner. It was not part of the judges. The judges were females, like about three females, the judges, you know. I think two of them left after the movie, after we finished watching the movie at the cinema. So they were calling that, where are these judges? So they now saw Uncle Femi. They said, Uncle Femi, who oh, yeah, you by microphone? A announce in your to win, and he said, Who won? He said, Bob Risky, only at Bob Risky. and he just announced it. So, you going to his page to blast him, to insult him, that's no nice. That is no nice, okay? Uncle Femi just took the mic because they asked him that uh, Bob Risky is the winner, and he announced it. Will he say he will not announce it? Will he say no? So, you guys going to say, uh, Is it? Is, like, is he sleeping with me? Is it this? Is it that? That's not nice. We need to be fair. Okay? So that's Uncle Femi's part. Now, secondly, I really look so good. I really look good. And I killed the theme of their outfits for that day. They said, what's the, I think they said they're royal beasts. Yes. So a lot were dressing out of the theme. I, Bobriski, I follow the theme. And I think that's what made me, you know, want the money. Okay? The theme of that, uh, of the movie premiere was, can I have that thing? Bring it. The check. Yes, there's one name I want. The check, the check. Yeah. Just, just all this. Okay, so the theme of the uh, movie premiere was royal beasts. They did not say dress like a village beast. They never said dress like a momo beast or wear anything. They just said, this is the theme of this um, premiere, royal beast. And I went and I, I took my time. I called all my glam team. My makeup artist, yes, I, I'm on his life. I called everybody, my stylist, you know, let's follow this theme because I want to kill it. I want to win the money. I want people to know that, yes, Maurice can dress. And I went, and they all saw every one of us on the, you know, the female parts, and, they, and I won. So why is the noise? Why are people screaming? Anyway, I'm here to tell you that. See, this movie, Beast of the Two, Beast of Two Words, is mad. Me, I'm there to watch the, the, the movie in, in, right there in the cinema. It's lit. Best movie ever. So if you like, please just go and watch it. It's super interesting. It's lovable. It's all said, but she really deserved the award. Thank you so much. So people, some of you here, now they reason well. Now those haters, you see those haters, they don't reason well at all, you know. But like I said, all of us are not the same people. So obviously, some of us are literate and some of us are illiterate. Obviously, I'm not going to come here and my sister is calling me. Please, I'm on live. Don't call me. So back to what I was saying, the beast 
of two words trust me that is the like my favorite movie right now the movie is epic traumatic suspense a lot of things is happening there and that is why hi bob brisky i had to follow the theme and i slid so don't judge me okay that's one number two some of us saying here but risky are you a woman are you a this are you a that i'm not here to come and argue anything respect people how they want to be addressed that's number one even without just looking at my body without opening my body to see anything number one you need to respect people how they want to be addressed i can see a lot of a lot of women coming out you know saying different things i will not insult anybody i love women women are the most powerful you know gender in the world so i'm not coming here to come and say oh they are this they are that see you guys say you have no choice you have to accept women part of the sisterhood do you hear me you guys have no choice i'm part of the sisterhood already so deal with it okay deal with it i'm seeing so many mothers adults coming out to say I can never insult mothers because obviously they're giving birth to someone like me. So obviously, girls, I fuck up. Okay. So I can't come out and insult anybody or say anything to anybody because they are older women. She gets. I'll just say if you are angry that I warn, I'm sorry, but not sorry because I warn the thing. And my makeup practice actually did a good job because i can see it's giving me idea that ah you don't talk about me before google q <laughs> it, was, it was giving me idea that, you know so so groovy won for the male category he won one million naira for the movie beast of two worlds the movie premium which went on smoothly but sadly the whole dress thing has kind of taken the the shine away from the movie people are not even mentioning the movie as they are criticizing bob risky and femi adebayo but i feel like it's not a big deal but risky actually huge to be like i saw the queue with the other ladies they should have said oh no bob is not a woman let's kick him out but they kept calm and all of a sudden they are offended i feel like they should just let it go it's not a big deal bob has always identified as a woman i mean he has identified as a woman for the longest time so i think that should be respected it's not a big deal <laughs> So I would say I need people to focus on the movie. Let's focus on promoting this amazing movie, Beast of Two Worlds, because people who saw the movie shared that the movie is very interesting and so guys let people focus on that and leave bob risky alone it's his luck and there's nothing anyone can do about it beast of two worlds will be out by the 29th of march 2024 so ensure you go to the cinema closest to you and watch it because guys it is going to be lit and i am not even kidding you it's going to be super interesting and like i said people who have seen the movie said the movie is one for the books so bob risky or not go see that movie so tell me how many of you observed that bob risky and the guy in this video bob risky was actually on instagram live and the guy in this video are obviously in the same spot so could it be that this is his partner or a paid actor to be very honest guys i don't know it is really funny sometimes i, I have always felt like bob brisky wasn't gay like for the longest time i thought all the gay talks he was probably joking or just being funny or trying to create content i mean bob has a way of saying things to keep people busy like the whole talks about undergoing and um, 
you know bbl and all that i knew all those yeah lies but i was pretty shocked when g started coming out that bob is actually he actually does men i was like oh well that's his choice as much as it's prohibited here but then it is what he, it is meanwhile guys even if you're having a bad day or you're or you're unhappy i need you to take out 30 seconds of your time to just say thank you jesus that black very black man and be very dark man is still behind bars like long may he remain there can i get an amen amen baby